And good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you happen to be tuning in to the broadcast all over the world. Welcome back to Cisco Live 2023 Amsterdam. We are so happy to have all of you with us here on the stream. My name is Steve Moulter. I am one of your four Cisco Live hosts coming to you from the beautiful Rai here in Amsterdam. And guess who another one of my fabulous hosts is? Good morning, Dish Parker. Good morning, Steve Moulter. <laughs> we are back, day two, really excited. How are you feeling? You know what? I feel fantastic, I really do. I'm loving the energy, the dynamic, the voice is not cooperating with me, but <laughs> we okay. soldier on, we do, what we need to do, right? You know, the thought of missing out on a Cisco live feed, I think it actually breaks my heart a little bit, a lot. This because, is what Wendy was talking about yeah. yesterday in the keynote, right? After three years of delay, we're actually back in the room. The last time you and I had a chance to do this was in January of 2020 in Barcelona. Right. And it's just been far too long. And just that alone, I don't care what my voice is doing, I'm going to be here in the room with everybody. I know. And I mean, it comes around a week a year, every year in each region, like in the Namia. So it's like a very special week for us, definitely a highlight of my year. And I know for a lot of attendees exactly the same right so many people are here they're excited to connect they wait for the year to come by and for the event to come by um, and we've had such a jam-packed first oh, day it's just amazing 10,000 people with us here in the room heaven knows how many of you streaming uh, online let's talk really really quickly uh, about the highlight of the keynote and really what I thought yesterday just kicked this off in such incredible energy by um, by Wendy and by uh, uh, Liz and by uh, uh, Jonathan and Javed Khan and Tom Gillis and Adela Trombetta. It was an incredible mix. Great inspiration, great motivation, excitement, all based around new technologies, based around hybrid, based around security. So what we should do right now, I think, is take a look at a couple of the highlights of Let's yesterday and then that, you yes. and I can come back and chat about them. Here we go. to Cisco Live EMEA. Together, we can achieve incredible things. Together, we are building an inclusive and sustainable future for all. And I know that we are all in. There you go. I mean, what a great sense of the energy and what it's like to be here in the room for Cisco Live 2023 Amsterdam. And, you know, I, I loved exactly what Wendy kicked off with yesterday, right? And you just heard it right there. There's so much opportunity. There is right. so much untapped potential when we come together, customers, partners, the entire Cisco ecosystem. We really can build that inclusive, sustainable future for all. And ultimately, I think that's what this whole event is about, right, Nish? Absolutely. And you know, I was really lucky to have some really cool conversations. We had lots of different guests in the studio yes. yesterday. And a lot of them talked about the journey that they're on with customers. We had a lot of Cisco leaders who were sharing that. And actually seeing how people are in different stages of the journey, but we're all in it together. And we're all working towards, you know, a lot of the, the same things and trying to achieve a lot of the same outcomes. Um, sustainability was something that was, you know, front and center in the front um, in the keynote, um, and through all the conversations that I certainly have with, had with guests, and I know, you know, we all um, did as well. So exactly, sustainability. By the way, the sustainability zone right down the hall from us here in the hub. Right, we're going to come back to it a ton today. We talked a lot about it yesterday, and again, great conversations. Just. It's just so much fun to talk with people, right? Absolutely. And speaking of talking with people, Steve had the opportunity to go around the show. So let's take a look at this quick, really fun video. We 
are all about technology. We're the world's best technology company, great. But the technology we produce here at Cisco, it only makes sense if it also supports and empowers the people who use it. Your people at home, your people at the office, your people anywhere, and the people here at Cisco Live this week here in Amsterdam, and I wanna go find some of those people. Come on with me, let's go. How many Cisco Lives have you done up until this point? I've been to about 14. You're almost a triple net vet here at this point. You realize that, right? <laughs> yeah, well. <laughs> Congratulations. Uh, this is my first Cisco Live. Actually. This is not your yeah. first Cisco Live. It's my first Cisco Live. Isabella, it's your first Cisco Live. Oh, that's so great. Where are you from? Yeah, I'm from Paris. I could tell by the accent. <laughs> Paris as well? Paris, France, yes. Uh, one of my favorite places in the world. How many Cisco Lives have each of you been to? Uh, it's the fourth. This is your fourth one? Yeah. Yeah. And first one as well. Um, this is my first. This is your first Cisco Live? Yes. What yes. made you want to come to the show this year? Actually, um, I was encouraged, I was told by my company, by my friends, that this is a very exciting opportunity for engineers, for developers, for anybody who likes technology. What are you looking most forward to here at the show this week? Uh, for Cisco ACI. Yeah. Yeah, and DNA. For the community, for the people here. For me, I'm waiting for the breakout sessions, but the, the show here is pretty nice. You never have the chance to get so much information. It's the connections you can have, and you can't have those anywhere else. It's, it's getting here in person, connecting with people, like-minded network engineers, people in the same IT fields, pushing the boundaries of what tech can do today. What's your thoughts so far? It's been amazing. This is the first day, and so many days to come, and it's exciting. I love that so much. I hope we will see you many, many times throughout the course of the week. Do me a favor, come back and visit us over here in the studio. Okay, yes, I will, definitely, I will. <laughs> Welcome to the show. Thank you so much. Thank you. What a pleasure to talk with you. Thank you, absolutely. Thank you. There you go. This is a human first story, right, Nish? It's all about the people, and I just had such a good time. I want to remind everybody, if you missed anything in yesterday's broadcast, don't worry at all. You're going to find it all in the on-demand library at CiscoLive.com. You can check it out there. So, Nish, I want to talk a little bit about what's coming up today, yes. right? We're going to look at the next chapter of hybrid work. We are going to look at accelerating secure innovation. We will look a lot at FSO for modern applications, full stack observability, zero trust for multi-environment IT. Um, we've got new IoT innovations here at the show that really help to, to simplify IT for industrial networks. So much on the way today. I was going to say, sure is that, that all stay in with one us. day? Well, I mean, look, that's, <laughs> that's a, lot, that's a right? fraction of what <laughs> we're going to do, right? All the way up to that closing keynote. What, have you, uh, what are you looking most forward to today? What do you think is going to be most exciting? Well, you know, I had a guest in the studio yesterday who was saying, you really have to be selective about how you use your time at Cisco Live. And the beauty of it is that if you miss something live, that's OK, because you go and watch it on demand. So I'm going to make sure I you know, have a mix I think we're going to be, you know, speaking to some guests out in the world of solution. We'll be heading to the Cisco Showcase, um, back here in the studio, spending lots of time with our wonderful audience at home, Yay. and obviously dancing along to the DJ because that's keeping me energetic. And you've you know, been dancing so much. We just took the coat off a moment ago. <laughs> yeah. You know what I want to do? I want to remind everybody: please stay connected to us using hashtag Cisco Live EMEA. And in fact, as long as we're talking social media, I'm going to send it directly back behind us, where my buddy Cedric Duvalder is hanging out in the social media circle. Good morning, Cedric. Good morning, Steve. Good morning, Nish. I am so excited to be here at day two for Cisco Life EMEA. And as you said, Steve, like social media is important for us. It's so important to hear from you at home. And even if you're at the conference, I'm here at Social Media Central, where actually we have a whole team that's engaging with us. So just let's have a further look. So over here, we have actually a big screen, as you can see, where all of your tweets and all of your social media interactions are being shown at the conference live here at Cisco Live using the hashtag, hashtag Cisco Live EMEA. So let's check out what's on the screen right now. So of course, like, you know, oh, Nicole is there, like Chief Stropafel Officer. I still need to get one. So Nicole, if you hear this, like, keep one aside for me. But also, I have here with me Kathleen, who is our social media manager. So hey, Kathleen, how are you? Great. It's another great day at Cisco Live. Yeah. Great. So social media, like, you know, we are past COVID now. We have it back in person, Cisco Live, but still, like, we have a lot of viewers on the broadcast. So social media is such an important uh, part for Cisco Live. So what are you actually doing here? 
Yes, we're monitoring the conversation and engaging with our delegates and encouraging the conversation. We love to see the relationships that start before the event and then they connect on site or those who are participating online, engaging the conversation and then the friendships last long after the event. So we love to see the conversation continue all year long. Great. And I'm assuming you're not doing this alone, right? Like there is a whole team behind it. So how's that going? That's right. We have a whole team because we want to make sure we see all the posts and engage with all the delegates participating in the conversation. Great. And they're actually on the other side over here on the social media. So let's just have a quick look there as well. Um, so you can see like maybe they can wave. See, like that's the team over there. And also, not to forget, Kathleen, we have a hashtag uh, Cisco Life EMEA, but we also have hashtag DJ CLER. So, what's that about? Yes, if we have a DJ on site, and you can request a song by tweeting to DJ Clure, and he will play your song. Awesome. So if you're at home and like you're not here, first of all, I'm telling you, you have to be here next year, right? But second of all, if you want to live, if you want to live the spirit of Cisco Live, use that hashtag, hashtag DJ CLEUR, and Kathleen will make sure that, that, that your song that you tweeted is being played. We're going to go back to Steve right now to the studio. So Steve, are you there? I am here, Cedric. A great job. Please send our thanks over to the social media team. My favorite thing that you just said, if you're home and you're not here, if you're home and you are here, then we absolutely have to chat with one another because that's a completely different scenario. We want to hear what it means to you to be with us here at Cisco Live. How did you prepare for the show? What is the best quote that you have heard from one of our speakers? Did you post a uh, great photo maybe of yourself, great selfie or something with you and your friends? Just remember to add hashtag Cisco Live EMEA. So I think we're going to head on out to our own. No, we're going to head out to Rob Boyd in a moment, I've just been told. So uh, Nish, did yes. you pick up on any really fun tweets? Did you see anything over on the tweet wall over here at social media? Well, I did not realize that DJ Claire was taking requests. I know. I'll be getting my Bad Bunny and my Ozuna, you know, Latin songs in because that's like my, my dance jam. Oh, which, absolutely. Uh, you know, gets me ready for the day when I'm getting ready in the morning, ready to come to studio. That's what I'm listening and dancing to. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to be looking forward to it. Yeah. Now we are going to head out to our own Rob Boyd. Rob's going to talk security out in the Waz and the show isn't even open yet. Rob, what are you seeing? Well, this is a lot of fun over here. This is what I'd call kind of a casual, relaxed approach to security. Now, technically, I'm just behind you guys as well just over your shoulder, one hop right over from the social media area in terms of right here in the front when you walk in. You can stop by here and get, get coffee, tea, make sure you're fresh for taking care of. The lines are generally quite decent. But if we pan around, we'll start over here. They're doing live presentations with different expert speakers with Q&A that can get quite in depth. They're also collecting information for uh, testimonials. So customers are stopping by and giving video testimonials about their experience with various Cisco security solutions. But in general, there's also, not in general, specifically, there's also uh, quite a few technical demonstrations going on over here, all in the area of cloud and cloud security. So from here, we've got cloud security, of course, firewall network security, and zero trust with Duo. With Cisco now moving more uh, specifically into the SSE space, as we have been in SASE and technically have all the components for SSE, now we're bringing all that together when you talk about uh, combining Duo as well as... Um, what was the other technology now I'm forgetting? XDR. XDR, and that brings it all together. These guys are always bailing me out. But anyway, I encourage you to stop by the security booth on your way by into the show. All right, thank you so much, Rob. Really appreciate it. Great preview for the day. So many great security products here at the show, right, Nish? Absolutely. I mean, here in the world of solutions, also in the showcase, we had the honor of going there yesterday and taking a look. Lots going on. Indeed, so much going on. SecureX, cloud native security, um, threat detection and response, Talos, great visibility across your whole threat landscape. And what's really cool is every step of the way, whatever we attach security to, it's always about serving people. How do we do that? How do we grow community? How do we benefit as many people as we possibly can? One of the best ways that we do it, as we were talking about earlier in sustainability, net zero, right? Yes. How do we do it? We constantly increase the energy efficiency of our products and our services. We embed secure, circular economy. We accelerate where and how we use renewable energies. Right, big investments in uh, carbon removal. We're going to replay one of our best stories yesterday, accelerating our journey to net zero with Cisco Solutions. Go for it.